Hey guys, what's going on? It's Billy here from the best place to play Golden Online. I hope you're having a fantastic day. So today is the 12th of May, 2016, and just continuing on with uh, some of the uh, top stories today with regards to uh, gold and uh, its performance in the first quarter of this year. Uh, the title of this article, uh, which is on Economic Times um, website, which is Economic Unrest Fuels Gold Demand, and this came, comes from the World Gold Council. They said that global gold demand surged in the first quarter as investors seeking refuge from financial unrest swooped on the commodity seen as a safe haven and, um, investment. Uh, just continue on this, the Guardian has written gold demand soars 21% in strongest first quarter on record. Negative interest rates and global uncertainty are likely to boost um, demand further, says the World Gold Council. And uh, obviously I touched on this yesterday with obviously uh, JP Morgan and uh, Goldman Sachs and uh, a few other banks obviously given their gold forecast. And uh, this trend is obviously going to continue. And it seems now that obviously the mainstream media seems that everybody's got the uh, the gold bug. And um, they're really sort of jumping on uh, with this um, flight to gold away from fiat currencies and paper assets. So... Obviously, just quickly going over to Google with obviously Gold News. Um, obviously, the Telegraph has put negative interest rate sparks record gold rush as demand for safe haven asset. Uh, gold demand breaks first quarter record. Gold demand is off to its uh, fastest start ever in 2016. And this trend just continues and just continues. Um, and I think you're going to see a lot more of this hit the mainstream now. And... Um, as this whole um, system starts to unwind. Whether this is the end of this uh, current fiat based system this time around, uh, I do not know. Uh, we'll yet to find out. However, gold, it seems gold prices will continue to go higher for as long as central banks continue their negative interest rate policies and uh, uh, other lower interest rate policies. Um, we are going to see, obviously, gold um, continue to go higher. Obviously, I touched on yesterday with regards to uh, J.P. Morgan, with regards to them saying that about the $1,400 mark being a very, very key level. Uh, I pretty much um, have maintained that myself, and um, I will very, very soon I'll, uh, I'll get up the charts and I'll show you exactly why uh, the $1,400 mark is very key and very significant. But for now. Um, this is just a quick video, quick update uh, to end the week. Um, it's been a really good week, a uh, really good um, week for gold, really good week for Legacy Gold. We launched this week and um, we've actually uh, smashed in the first six hours our uh, six monthly uh, target for sales. So really, really pleased with that, really, really excited about this opportunity with Legacy Gold. And um, if you want to learn more about uh, what it is that we have on offer, go ahead and check out goldfinancial.de. And... Um, Go ahead and register yourself for a free account if you wish. If you haven't done so already, go ahead and uh, hit the subscribe button on this YouTube channel. And um, feel free to drop your thoughts in the comments below. Uh, I'd love to hear from you. And uh, I'll see you on the next video. Take care. Have a fantastic weekend. Cheers. Bye.